A lot of our clients in an enterprise space have, have a challenge. They've stopped adding headcount in their sales staff, they have too many customers or prospects that they can get after, and their marketing team's running all over the place, producing great content, but they don't know its effectiveness or its usage, and, and we're kind of at a point where we're at capacity all around, they're trying to figure out the best use of that. The challenge they face is optimization or relevancy and making sure that their salespeople are getting to the right contacts at the right time. This is the problem we helped our FinServe clients solve. The solution we worked with our customer on was really driving the consensus across sales and marketing leaders across a few different business groups to really come up with a better way to measure digital effectiveness and engagement. We worked to install Pardot tracking code on a number of web properties or assets or materials at different stages of that cycle that a, a prospect or customer would engage with it. That information then fed into the sales cloud, which fed into lead scoring. By bringing in lead scoring into this solution, uh, they're able to track customer activity across all sorts of channels. We deployed our insights, ideas, and roadmap process. In the insights phase, what we did is we met with various different roles within the business itself. Marketing responsibilities, sales responsibilities, leadership responsibilities, and technology responsibilities to get an understanding of where they were all coming from and how we could tie them all together. We mapped out the process from initial contact between an advisor and the company, whether that was digital or whether that was with an individual, and ultimately what truly needed to evolve in that technology landscape. For example, we had to switch out the web analytics program so that we could feed the data to the right places to make decisions on the digital behaviors of the advisors. And finally, we spent quite a bit of time with their technology team understanding their whole ecosystem as many systems needed to touch the end, end solution to drive the data points that we needed, but also not create a whole different path of how we would change a huge technology infrastructure. From then, we were able to move into our ideas phase and really drive alignment across three different business units on what objectives they needed to drive to and what outcomes we needed the solution to get to. We did some broad-based ideation and then ultimately we prioritized against the business value that each feature would drive, the technology feasibility that existed there and how much work each one of those pieces would be to onboard, and really understanding their organizational readiness. Ultimately, that led to the roadmap, and we built a four-phase roadmap over the course of about two years of how they would roll out this solution in chunks. So at the end of each phase, they were left with functioning things that they could be using with their market. Moving on to the next phase, how they would build on each piece and grow the functionality that they had in place. Ultimately, each one of those phases drives significant business value and reaches their end customer. We had a lot of rock stars on this project, on the Magna360 side and on the customer side. We worked very hard at the project level, week after week, sprint after sprint, showing off the work that we'd done to the client and receiving feedback. This project has really become one of our featured stories in helping Salesforce to answer the question, when should we use Pardot, when should we use Marketing Cloud, and when should we use the two together? So we've really used this case as an example of when Marketing Cloud can be used for true uh, end customer engagement across many channels, yet we can plug in Pardot behind the scenes for a cohesive solution to add lead scoring to the mix. And it's really helped us to establish a great position with Salesforce uh, in answering this question. So from an outcome perspective, we're in a great spot with our client. They, from bringing sales and marketing together, one of the things that their sales team is selling us is that when, I'm, when I go through my call list and it, when I connect with those individuals, all of a sudden I'm relevant. I'm, I'm topical, they're just thinking about me and I'm not showing up in a way that scares them because I just saw that they were on our site, but I'm showing up in a way that's helping them. From a marketing perspective, it's very valuable too. Our marketers now aren't, aren't trying to figure out the value of their content. They can actually see what's engaging that customer and what the customers are utilizing and then they can connect and have a better dialogue with sales and we really have a lot to thank to the marketing cloud and that technology of how it's able to work together to create journeys, use Pardot to create the tracking code, and then feed that into the sales cloud. So by weaving these kind of multi-clouds together, we're able to produce great uh, synergies across sales and marketing.